Carl Van Devender. He's going to tell you a little bit about his Manure Evaluator app and uh, some of the what he's learned in the process of developing that one. It's all yours, Carl. Thanks, Jill. And uh, you know, good afternoon, everybody. And Jill said learning process for me, and that's exactly what it was. Uh, in my career working with the uh, animal manure, is a question that comes up time after time after time. Well, how much is it worth? And the answer to that is it depends. And I've got tired of saying that, so I started looking at the app as a possible way to help uh, landowners uh, put a value on their manure, both as it applies to their ground, but possibly as it may apply to their neighbor's ground who needs the phosphorus, and Arkansas is typically an issue, who needs the phosphorus, so it may be more valuable to a neighbor than the producer. Uh, this particular app is available both in the App Store and also the Android Play Store, and we decided to make it free. Uh, the development team on this was, I was working as the content uh, expert, if you want to say that, and my coworker, Dominda Sheriswat, uh, was developing and working and getting started in the area of app development. And he was utilizing the hourly label from undergrads and even sometimes high school students to do the programming. So it was kind of done in-house, everybody trying to feel their way through the process. Uh, the purpose of the app and uh, was very simply just to be able to calculate the maximum potential value of a manure, a particular batch of manure, and the actual value of that manure in terms of a nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium uh, fertilizer replacement as applied to an individual particular field where you had a soil, a soil test recommendations. So the inputs to this were the nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium uh, prices, uh, the user has the ability to enter it either in terms of dollars per pound for NP and K or, or dollars per ton for the bulk fertilizer, and the app would calculate that uh, for you. Uh, my experience is it seems like, at least in Arkansas, uh, producers have a better feel for what the bulk fertilizer price is, and uh, then they have to start scrambling around and figure out what the per pound price is. Then the next thing would be the enter into soil test uh, recommendations in terms of pounds per acre. Uh, next question is at input is what's the manure value in terms of what's the concentration, the nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium in the manure. And these, the app supplies some historical book values uh, based on samples that have been sent to the U of A lab. Uh, then the user has the ability to edit those to hopefully match up with what his soil test, rec um, excuse me, manure recommend uh, analysis is. And the final step is the manure application rate. So if you take these various inputs, uh, the app then calculates the output that you see on the screen. And that's just really the bottom of the calculational things and the top table is just simply the nutrient application rate results. If you apply this manure at this rate, this is what you get. Uh, first column is dealing with the recommended. That's what was input. Uh, then it provides how much is actually applied, then calculates how much fertilizer was over or under applied with that particular manure source. Uh, one of the things I've been trying to make a point of is manure is an excellent fertilizer, but it's a pre-blended fertilizer. So you, you have to blend it in, use it with other fertilizer sources. Sometimes you over-apply, sometimes you under, and it's a balancing act. The next table was really kind of getting at where the app was focused was manure value results. And the first column is dealing with the absolute maximum potential value of the manure in terms of that's just simply the price of NP and K times the content. And it total it all up. An example you see on the screen, it's $108 ballpark. But when applied to this particular field at this particular rate, uh, the sum of those numbers is actually only $82 or thereabouts. Uh, so you're losing $22 uh, of value there or somewhere around in that neighborhood. So what that's saying is it may be more valuable to a neighbor who needs the phosphorus that the landowner who's generating manure has already got plenty of. And of course, it also calculates the application and rate in dollars per acre. Um, again, the whole idea is just one 
answer a very short, narrow, focused question, how much is this manure worth? Uh, and it kept the scope of the app tight, and we tried to uh, really have a quick, focused uh, tool with very little in terms of uh, data entry and or and uh, data savings. Uh, you will notice at the top of the screen, uh, right hand side of the app, there's a place where you can actually email your the results to you in the, for in the form of a little picture image. Uh, 